Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel and we are going to Magic Kingdom. It is 6.40, it is Saturday, no, Friday, <laughs> July 15th and we're going back to Magic Kingdom, well, to Magic Kingdom, um, 6.40, a little later than we expected but we spent a lot more time at, um, at Epcot. First, we're gonna go to Top of the World Lounge because it just reopened, so we're headed over there now to Top of the World Lounge and then headed to Magic Kingdom. And um, Magic Kingdom's open till 11. So we'll probably have about three hours at Magic Kingdom. And they have the fireworks um, enchantment is going to be showing at 9, 20 and 11. So I think if we catch any of the fireworks, it will probably be the 11 o'clock showing because that's after the park is closed. And we've seen it before. Oh, right. So we've seen it before, so not really too worried, but you know, Let's, let's go to Magic Kingdom. So this is Bay Lake Tower. So um, we're gonna go up to the top of the lounge real quick. So it is 6.55 and it's actually quite a long line. Okay, so change of plans. We're not gonna go to the top of the lounge because they've changed the rules. So um, for DVZ members, if you're planning on going to Top of the World Lounge, we went at seven o'clock. Um, we went up. We went up there, and basically, you put your name on a waiting list. But they are now serving. It's like Wicked something. It's fifty-five dollars, and you reserve a table. And what they're saying is that the people that are reserving a table for fifty-five dollars, they are staying for about three hours to the first round of fireworks at 9.20. And then at nine, after the first round of fireworks, they open the observation deck and then um, they will open it up and we wouldn't be able, if we were able to get a table, then we can order appetizers or food. However, if there's no tables available and we just go to the observation deck, then we can get a drink at the bar and go to the observation deck, but we cannot order, order food. So that's the, that's the thing. Um, that's fine for us. Um, you know, I had heard about the $55 thing, but um, we weren't sure of what we were gonna do, were we gonna make it, but know that because there was quite a few people in, in front of us and they were like, this information should be on the website, which I agree, this should, information should be on the website. Um, so we put our name on the wait list and he said, you probably won't be called until after the first round of fireworks, which we're gonna go to Magic Kingdom anyway, so it's fine, but hey, we got parking. And now we're headed to, to Magic Kingdom. So, um, you know, that was the, it worked, honestly, it kind of worked out for us, so. Maybe I'll get a drink. Um, and they're open till midnight. Park closes at 11. Fireworks are, at, second fireworks tonight are at 11. So we'll see what happens. And we are back. Last time we were here was the, um, was it wasn't the Christmas party. It was the very merry after hours. And Ryder was sleeping. So just, it's great to be back. Ryder was So. We're gonna go over here. We took another picture with a photographer named Brenna who was really nice, but we didn't do a bag of shot, so maybe this guy has another shot. I raised my son right. His first ride, he wants to be the people mover. I'm raising him right. Backwards? Okay. Stay clear of the doors, which will open and close. The next station is Tomorrowland Urban Planning and Star Traders. Transfer to Green and Red Lines. People to go! Red Lines, Red Lines! Rolling through the future. Right now, buddy. Keep it open. John, go on, hit it. But um, it was fun. Now we're gonna head to Barnstormer. There's only a 10 minute wait on the app, so hopefully that's right. Um, and then the fireworks are in about an hour. So we're hoping, the first set. So we're hoping that um, the ride lines, because the rides are really long. I mean, it's July. We never come at this time of year. 
Um, so hopefully the lines will start to die down uh, during the fireworks. So my Disney experience said 10 minutes. Here we got here and it says 20 minutes. So um, it is what it is. He wants to ride it. So we're headed to Big Thunder. Actually, Ray and Ryder are already there. I have to go to the bathroom. So they are headed, they're at the playground at Splash Mountain. And I'm headed over there now. We're gonna do Big Thunder and then Splash Mountain because it looks like a small form is gonna come through. And I'm afraid both of these are gonna get closed. Ryder, I think you're getting too big for this place. Yeah, I think he is getting too big for this place. Well, you say he's getting too big, I'm too big. <laughs> So here we go, Big Thunder. 35 minute wait, not too bad. Ryder, what are we about to ride? And what is it? Ready to ride the wildest ride in the wilderness? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. We're riding it. We're riding it, we're in it. Splash Mountain and you can hear the fireworks go off, which is, it's just cool. Okay, it looks pretty dry. That's promising, that's promising. Sing it, honey. <laughs> This is pretty awesome, watching the fireworks from Splash Mountain. There's screens in the background. <laughs> okay, that was just pretty cool. <laughs> Awesome. We went on Splash Mountain, didn't get too wet. I look so white in this light. <laughs> uh, but it was great. We're gonna head over to Seven Dwarfs Mine Drain. The lines, the fireworks are over for the first one and um, the lines have definitely died down. So if you guys can, there are two fireworks um, during the summer and, and you can't, your kids can handle staying up late, um, I would definitely recommend doing the second round of fireworks because um, you know it's definitely easier to ride the rides, the more popular rides during the first set of fireworks. So the weather held up today. Thank it God. was a gorgeous day. So let's just hope it holds we up are tomorrow. hoping it holds up for tomorrow because tomorrow we are going to H2O Nights at Typhoon Lagoon. So we are keeping our fingers crossed. If the weather is like this, we will be golden. So we're headed now to Seven Dwarfs Mine Train and then we're gonna head to Space Mountain for the last ride and then hopefully catch the fireworks at Top of the World if we can get in. They already called us for a wait list, but we were here um, and we don't want to leave yet. So we'll see what happens. We'll figure it out. And this is Small World has been a five minute wait this whole time. It's the one ride that has like no wait to it. So we're going to go ride the carousel. We haven't done that in a while. Let's do it. It'll be fun. Yeah, it's 10 o'clock. He said he wants one with a bunch of diamonds. <laughs> I don't know where he's going. Can we put this on? Over. We're gonna ride the carousel. There he is. Where is he? <laughs> Ryder got the biggest horse. Did. Ryder, did you get the biggest horse? Ryder, look up. Look at mommy. <laughs> okay, one more. So now we're in line for mine train. We're almost at the front and uh, making really good time. Thank you. 
So we just rode Space Mountain for the last time. He loves it. Um, so it's 11, I mean, sorry, it's 1045. We're gonna try, um, we got the text a little while ago that our table was ready or we had space available at Top of the World. Um, but we were in line for Seven Doors Mine Train at the time. So by the time we get there, we're gonna try and get there. The fireworks are in at 11, at 11 o'clock. So we're walking really fast. And I don't know if our spot will have been given up by the time we get there. So we'll see, but um, either way, we'll avoid the crowd, um, you know, and then I don't know what we'll do if, if we can't get up, but we'll see, Let's, fingers crossed. So we're headed off to Bay Lake Tower now. We have 10 minutes to get there. So I'm gonna end the video for our evening at Magic Kingdom. It was a great night. We did a lot. We pretty much did all the fast stuff. The only thing that was slow that we did was the carousel. Um, it was great. It was a great night, short night, um, but riders at the age where that's all he wants to do. So can't complain. So if you like this video, click like, click and subscribe. That way you get a notification every time I post a new video. And next video will be whether or not we get into Top of the World Lounge. Bye everyone.